first movement of Beethoven 6 is another one of those classic excerpts that gets asked all the time in auditions. I'm just going to give you a little uh, hint as to the way I practice it at times leading up to an audition. There's three things that I do to kind of get the overall sound of the excerpt and the articulation to be as consistent and as good as possible. The first way is I actually start by just slurring everything. All of these triplets eventually are going to get tongued, but I start by slurring so that I can get an evenness of tone throughout the range. After I've practiced slurring it for a while, then I move to a legato tongue. So constant air, just as if I'm slurring, and I just add a light touch of the tongue. After that, I move bit by bit to just shorten up that articulation a little bit until I get to the staccato articulation that I want. And the whole time, whether I'm slurring, playing legato, or shortening up to staccato, I try to keep the airflow continuous. So there's always air moving through the instrument and it's just the tongue that's giving me the articulation. I use the lower notes as a little bit of a springboard as I go up the arpeggios. That way, the higher notes don't pop out as much louder than the lower notes. With the Beethoven 6 first movement, I usually start a little slower, slurring, legato, and then staccato, and then I move up the tempo, trying to keep the consistency of the sound and the articulation all the way through. Now toward the end of this excerpt, I sometimes feel like I'm running out of breath. So I like to practice it, just taking those triplets even further, as far as I can in one breath. And then when I go back to the original way, it feels much easier. I'll show you what I mean. Piece of cake.